All right, today YouTube, we're gonna be doing a tutorial on some LA Girl magnetic nail polishes. So I have three different magnetic nail polishes and they're actually really cool the way they work. Um, so the first color that we have is this um, red burgundy color. Um, the sticker on the back came off, so I don't know the name of it. And then this one is like a greenish blue color and it's called magnetic field and then we have a purple one which is called electrostatic so these are the three colors um each color comes with a magnet that is built into the lid and each one has a different type of uh magnet inside that it will make so this one this magnet makes like a star pattern this one makes straight lines and this one has squiggly lines so um, what you do to use these are you paint one thick coat of polish over the nails and then you hold the magnet as close to the nail as possible for 10 to 20 seconds so i'm going to demonstrate um how to do this on my practice hand that I have. So I'll move these to the side for right now. So this is a practice nail that I have already tried two of the colors. I did the electrostatic on this nail and I used the star cap to do that. And so it has like a little star pattern on it. And I held it in two different places on the nail um, because the nail, the magnet is so small, the nail is kind of long, so you have to hold it in two spots to just make sure you get the magnet effect on the whole nail. So, did that for 20 seconds on two different parts of the nail. And then this one is the squiggly lines, and I used the red color that I do not have the name of the color for. And I did it at the tip, the top, and one on one side. Um, I have not top coated these yet but they actually come out pretty cool and I think it's a neat concept so I'm going to now do the blue turquoise green which is called magnetic field I'm going to put this one onto this nail and I'm going to use the straight cap to do that so I'm gonna take the cap off first um, just set it to the side so that I'm able to pick it up once I'm done painting so shake up or not shake up but roll my nail polish and I'm going to do a thick coat of polish onto the nail my painting is not going to be that good I'm actually actually upside down on this nail so that's okay Try to get it as thick as possible. Not too many streaks. So then you just take it and I'm going to turn the nail to the side so you can see. And you have to get it close. Three, four, five, so we've already got some lines. I'm just going to continue down it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So got some lines on it, as you can see. It's actually a pretty cool effect. Um I could have made it a little thicker on the bottom, I can tell. But for the most part, it looks really, really cool. So this is a simple way to get some magnetic nails. These polishes were actually at five below and they were $2 a piece. Um, so that's not a bad price.